there's one thing I want to make clear. Despite what the media has been telling you, the corporate media has been telling you day after day for the last few months, nobody is trying to take away a worker's right to a secret ballot. Nowhere in the Free Choice Act does it say we're going to take away the right to a secret ballot. What the law would do, the Free Choice Law would do, is give the workers the right to choose a secret ballot if they so desire in a union election, rather than letting employers, corporations, demand it. Workers would have the right to either have a secret ballot or do a un elect a union by just having co workers sign cards like more than 60 countries in the world today already do. In America today, about 7% of the private workforce is organized. That's the lowest rate of unionization of any democracy in the world. It is the lowest rate in the United States in over a hundred years. And the reason why this is so is not because workers don't want to organize. Every per survey that's taken in the last 50 years indicates that millions of workers in this country would like to organize a union, but it's impossible to do so under the present law. Impossible. Classic example is Walmart. Of all their thousands of stores in this country and millions of workers, none of them are a union member because they can't, because Walmart will fight them every step of the way, will fire them, will close the store if necessary to prevent them from organizing a union, as they have done. This is disgraceful in a, in a free democracy. And we've got to do something to, to, to change that, to allow workers to have a voice in deciding their wages, hours, and working conditions. And they have some protection against discriminatory conduct on the job, like every other free nation in the world. And the only way we're going to get that is by passing the Free Choice Act. And I hope you all join with me in seeing that it's done.